Today we're going to check out a longer version of Beltrust Twix. This is the 22 inch in Cookies with Cream. Coming up. I purchased this style. You can find it at Wig Studio One. If you drop below this video, I'll attach a direct product link there. If you click on the link labeled Beltrust Twix 22, it'll take you out to the Wig Studio One website. It'll show you all of the colors and the pricing. Remember, at Wig Studio One, Beltrust is an automatic 30% off at checkout. If you have any questions for us, please reach out to support at wigstudio1.com. Wig Studio One is now offering international shipping, so that is a good thing. And then also be sure to visit and join the private Facebook group called the Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. All of those links are also below. This is the newest progression of Beltrass Twix, now available in the 22 inch. If you remember, the original release was an 18 inch. It featured the same uh, tight crimped texture, but the fact that this is longer, they've really done it right. So they've added a little bit more layering to it. It feels very lightweight, not as dense as the original, I think, just because there's a little more layering. It features the same cap, so a temple to temple lace front, left monofilament side part. And if you really wanna go shorter than that 18 inch Twix, the Amber Rockstyle by Beltress is also features the same exact crimped kind of a tight spiral texture but it's just above the collar so it is a little bit shorter okay, so let's talk about what's different so if you really love the 18 inch and you're looking at investing in the 22 um i was a little worried that there wouldn't be enough layering and the 22 inch would just be out to here you know like the old time afros it's not like that at all so we just have a very similar density compared to the 18 but if you look in the back they have some tiered layering in the back. So it isn't overwhelming at all. So you see that graduated layering starting about shoulder and then down. So it really softens that look, that heavy look. Um, it just gives it a nicer density and look overall. Thank goodness they did some tapering because if that was just sort of a blunt cut, straight across, no layering, in that density carried through it would be a little bit much this one weighs about the same as the original twix which is between five and six ounces it feels lightweight on there's really very little permatees at all on on this and the density even though that density is quite average it's not overly thick each one of these fibers is very fun. This features the heat friendly fiber by Beltrass. It's soft, it's buttery feeling. And even though you get this crimped, kind of a fuzzy looking texture, you can certainly run your fingers through it. It's an indelible pattern here that um, is kind of set. So you're really not going to get any kind of fallout of this curl. This curl is meant to be the way it is through washings, through brushings. Um, and if you get it a little bit too fuzzy, which is what will happen if you if you brush it out too much, you can just add a squirt of water and just kind of scrunch in that water and allow it to dry and it will dry just like this. You can use your heat tools. Um, I wouldn't recommend trying to straighten a style with this kind of curly texture. First of all, it defeats the purpose. There's a lot of great straight styles out there by Beltress, um, but you're just never ever gonna get back this wonderful, unique texture. Everywhere I go when I wear Twix, I get compliments. Um, they're all kind compliments, like how did you get your hair? Is that natural curly hair? You know, just lots of questions about, um, you know, what I did to create this look. And when I have time, I'll stop and have that wig conversation because as we all know, it's just a, a jaw-dropping moment when you reveal the fact that it's a wig and that takes people by surprise because even though this is a big, bushy style, it doesn't look like a wig. It doesn't look unnatural. This is the Cookies and Cream Blonde, which is an ombre shade. It just isn't my favorite uh, look on this particular wig style. So this Cookies and Cream is an ombre shade. So we're starting with a darker root, which is sort of a medium taupey brown root that blends into a dark taupey blonde, very ashy blonde. And then you're going to see highlights and solid tips of platinum or white almost. It's one of the most ashy colors I've seen um, in production, and it does have that ombre effect, and I absolutely adore it on the Dalgona 16 that I have in this particular color. Um, on this one, I think it's a lot. I just think that um, 
there's a lot of platinum about halfway down and to the ends. The ends kind of disappear. I'm noticing that now that I have a light colored top on. Um, but in styling, I think you're really going to appreciate it because when we start to put it in updos and things, it just has a really cute look to it, a fashionable look. Um, I do want to make some remarks on this texture because I've heard that um, people are concerned about the frizzy look. But again, it's soft. You can run your fingers through it with ease. It's not damaged hair. That's the important thing to know. It might mimic damaged hair, but so does a lot of natural curly hair too. It just has that frizzy type texture with a roughed up cuticle um, that makes it look damaged, uh, but it absolutely is not. This is intentional. You just have to be a fan of it though if you order a Twix because this kind of a, a texture is also present on the 18 inch. So this one did come with a little bit of lift right there at the front. It exposes that lace front beautifully. Um, a very well done lace front and left monofilament side part assembly. They do take the highlight right up to that lace front. and the ear tab you know there's quite a bit of hair there but again it's just so soft and fine and there's no permatease at the ear tab so I feel like glasses fit nicely and securely between the ear and the ear tab so thanks so much for joining me today and I will be working on a comparison um, among the amber rock the original Twix 18 inch and then this 22 inch Twix so you can see them all side by side and choose which one is for you. So stay tuned to both Taz's Wig Closet and Taz's Wig Charm channels. <laughs>